Hey, what is up guys? My name is Jay and today we are going to continue our adventure through Sinnoh. Now I know that last time that we have um, gotten our second gym by defeating Gardenia, I think that's her name. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna make our way down and it looks like we have our first battle, but before we get into that, let's kind of like check our levels here. We got Scrambles at level 21, Mumble at level 24, Holy at level 18, Kaminari at level 23, and our Falco is also level 23. And to be honest, I do want to level up our Scrambles just a little bit, but because I'm pretty sure this jolly old fella has rock types, we are going to send out our Mumble instead. See how Mount Coronet was towers above us? I want to be big like that one day. Well, trust me, you are already big enough for that. Just look at you. Mm. Okay, so it looks like we're challenged by Hiker Lewis. Normally, we will skip these trainers, but I just figured that might as well, since it's our first trainer, we could go ahead and take him down. It's only a level 15 Geo dude. It shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I mean, how are your days going? Um, for me, it was a pretty long day. Uh, I took my friend to Costco. <clears throat> it was the first time that she's been there, so obviously we had to get a lot of samples from Costco. Unfortunately, I couldn't really eat anything because <clears throat> I've been doing this like detox thing where I have to like starve myself for like 15 days or like 10 days, and then I'm trying to train back up into more solid food so I don't really want to expose my system to any junk only because I'm very acne prone apparently because of all the inflammation in my body it's it's a lot of things going on but yeah uh, the starving part was wasn't as bad it was just that I was craving foods but you know it's all for the better mint of my f longevity I guess yes we would like to use rock smash I kind of forgot if this is the way we go, if we go down, um, but let's just head whichever way flows our boat. Okay, I'm going to use a repel real quick. I know, okay, here's our repel. Okay, we only have three repels, so we need to go and grab more repels. And okay, it seems like we're not supposed to go this way just yet. That is okay. We will simply go somewhere else. Um, oh yeah, I do remember. You're supposed to go down <clears throat> to this place. Okay, no, we don't need another repel, but we are going to use our bicycle. Last time I remember having trouble using our bike. Uh, yeah, the controls are a little iffy. Um, but yeah, I have finally figured out how to use our bike properly. So let's make our way down from Eterna City. Ooh, Route 26. Okay, I believe this is, oh man, we have another trainer. All right, looks like we got one or two trainers down. I'm gonna put scrambles up ahead just so that I can gain one level. Um, I feel like Scrambles is going to be an integral part of the team. Okay, we'll just face this trainer. Yeah, I, I think Scrambles is going to be an integral part of the team. Um, I know that we have our Falco, but if I have to be quite honest, every time I play this game, I always use the same six Pokemon revolving around Infernape. And I just want to try something a little different this time around. And um, I do remember um, me saying, uh, and like the beginning episodes, I think it was like episode one or two That I said that I kind of wanted to play this game a little differently So I kind of wanted my team composition to be a little different and I Said that but I ended up catching um, our Kaminari which is our Shinx and our Falco So I, I know I was a little bit of a hypocrite back then, but I think we are finally Getting to the point where we um, you know, are catching different kinds of Pokemon. I guess um, our Scrambles is also a Pokemon that other people could use, but I just personally never really used um, a Togepi in my team. Uh, 
it's just I believe there's just more work to going into getting a Togekiss than a Star Raptor. Like I think you have to grow its friendship to evolve, and then after that you have to use like a Shining Stone. I forgot the exact process, but you know you have to do something like that. Okay, let's try to avoid these chainers. Okay, that's good. We can't avoid her. Okay, well I, I won't skip these chainers only because. Um, you know, we do want to have our content be longer, and I also want to talk to you guys, you know? Even though I know that you guys won't be hearing this until probably a few weeks after I try to post every Saturday and just pre-recording these videos. Um, you know, once I get more efficient at editing videos and, you know, putting down clips and whatnot, I'm sure that I'm going to be able to post on the same day that I record this video. Who knows, maybe I'll even start streaming. But for now, because I am a novice, uh, I just need that extra prep time, you know? That's why I like to schedule and premiere my videos. Um, but yeah, I think on days that I, you know, wanna talk, I'll talk. On days that I just wanna skip these trainers, I'll skip these trainers, you know? I'll just do what it is that I'm feeling at the moment. Um, dang, our scrambles flinched. So that's the thing about Togekiss. One of the reasons why I don't use them is because it takes forever to evolve. Like, and when I say forever, it's because you know it's not as easy as leveling it up and evolving it. Okay, we're doing nothing to this thing, so we gotta start racking up some damage. But yeah, um, I've never really used a Togekiss before. Um, I'm excited to try it out. I know all this hard work is eventually going to pay off sometime. Let's just use another Ancient Power. We need to give Scramble some better moves, honestly. I'm pretty sure it's a special attack or so. I don't know, a flamethrower would be always nice to have. But yeah, um, this is also kind of like a good way for me to like practice speaking. Um, I, don't generally, I don't generally think that I'm that interesting of a guy. I don't really have a lot of stories to tell. And I am in my dorm room right now just, you know, playing Pokemon, which I, I understand is a little sad, but this is something that I genuinely kind of wanted to do. Um, you know, I do make YouTube videos on my main channel called J Today, but at the same time, uh, it's, uh, it's a little complicated. It's hard putting myself out there with all my face, mostly because I have a lot of acne and, you know, when you're in college, you just have a lot of insecurities. So, um, I feel like the best way for me to kind of combat that and still find a way to document my life is by just playing Pokemon, you know? Pokemon is something I've always grew up with, Pokemon is something that I enjoy, and I could talk to you guys and share a little bit of my life while I am enjoying the game, and hopefully you guys are enjoying me taking forever defeating this Shinx. Okay, we're gonna use our last ancient power and hopefully it'll crit or something because our scrambles cannot die. We cannot let this beautiful Togepi die. Oh, that is perfect. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna have to uh, switch out scrambles just so that it doesn't die because we don't want his uh, friendship to, you know, plummet. So we are going to go to our Pokemon. Who should we send out first? I, I think we gotta send out Holy, but I'm not sure if Holy really has a lot of attacking moves, but yeah, okay, so it seems like we made it through all that. Um, Honestly, I feel like today would kind of be a good day for us to try to go get another team member. Because this Pokemon, although I know it is very heavily overused. It is a Pokemon that I do um, want to get in our team. Um, yeah, so let's just make our way up here and hopefully we don't run into any trainers. A burn heal is definitely going to come in handy. Hopefully one day, okay, we are going to try to avoid that trainer. He is staring us down, okay. We're going this way, before he looks up, we're gonna go to this cave. You guys probably already know what Pokemon it is that I am trying to catch. Um, so once I find that Pokemon, I'll be right back. Okay, on second thought, I think it might be better if I just come back for the Pokemon. Oh my god. Um, 
only because like I feel like we've caught a lot of Pokemon today, and I can always go back and catch it later on. Right now, I just kind of want to progress with the game a little bit. Um, we're going to run from this point to... Okay, of course we couldn't get away. Um, okay. Yeah, we're, we'll, we'll just take down... Okay, no, we actually get all it safely. Okay. Yeah, so um, we are going to come back for that Pokemon later. Oh my gosh, that was close. Yeah, um... Let's just continue our way to our journey. I would bike, but my bike mechanic is not so good. So we are just going to run. The guy could use a little cardio anyway, since, you know, all of our lives are so sedentary. And we... Okay, we don't need that repel. Okay. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's the Dawn. Hi, G. Today, how's your Pokemon uh, Pokedex coming along? Me? I'm somewhere between fantastic and uh, hopeless. But this isn't about me. I've got something nice for you. J today. Choose which hand you want. Let's go with the left hand. I see, you want the VS Seeker. I'm impressed, Jay, today. You know what's important. You obtained the VS Seeker. I feel like even if we chose the right hand, we would have gotten the VS Seeker. Using that VS Seeker, you could find trainers who want to rematch with you. Oh, J today. Do you also have a Pokech? Yep, you do. You could have this too then. You deserve for all your hard work, Jay, today. So we got a dowsing machine. That will come in handy. Dowsing machine is something you should touch often. It will tell you if there's an item on the ground that you can't see. It will especially use. It will be especially useful inside dark caves. Okay, let's keep working on our Pokedexes. Professor Rowan is counting on us. Okay, we indeed shall keep working. One of the things that we are going to be doing is completing the Pokedex. Um, that's something I personally have never done before because I think it is a lot of work and quite frankly boring. So, uh, yeah, we just don't do that. Okay, it looks like I just wasted a potion on reviving 1 HP and Holy, but... Yeah, I do want to use Holy and Scrambles more for the battle. I think that's how you evolve Togepi. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. And looks like we got ourselves a double battle. thinking that our team is very weak um like really weak so i'm gonna go to the pokemon center real quickly and then i'll come right back okay i am back we are all healed and i want to put my scrambled up first because i want to raise this friendship as much as possible i'm gonna try to skip okay looks like we have another battle What? Holy is evolving. <laughs> okay, quite honestly, I did not expect this thing to evolve this quickly. Um, quite frankly, I don't really know when it was supposed to evolve, but I thought it'd be like 20 something. Congratulations, your holy evolved into a Curlia. Well, that's nice. I really wish that my scrambles was one that evolved, but it looks like we need more friendship. Oh, wait, I need more repels, but I don't have any. Okay. Um. Yeah, we'll just we'll just tank through this cave. Hopefully, we won't run into too many. Uh, and yeah, I'll just get these for you. 
Yeah, hopefully we don't run into too many trainers. Oh, looks like that is the boss. According to 1-3, Mount Coronet is where the Sinnoh region began. In a newly created world, a world where only time flowed and space expanded, there should have been no strife. But what came of that world? Because the human spirit is weak and incomplete, strife has spread. This world is being ruined by it. I find the state of things to be deplorable. Okay then. Sorry to hear that. But in a sense, uh, I also know what he means. Uh, I do feel like the world could be a little nicer sometimes. You know, I just feel like people are very uh, closed off at times. And me, uh, someone who used to be an extrovert and now have mellowed down a lot due to age, um, have found it harder for me to build more meaningful relationships uh, and looks like we got ourselves a battle okay so now that we have defeated that humongous onyx oh that is close we do not want to be encountering any more trainers? Okay. Oh, that was close. Okay. Yeah. So, kind of going back to the relationship thing. Um, yeah, I just feel like it's a little harder to um, get people to actually care about you in a sense that is uh, meaningful. I'll elaborate later. Looks like we have a binary. Oh, thank goodness that you happen to be there. If it weren't for you, who knows how far away my Baneri could have run. Baby Baneri, get back in the Pokemon you go. I'm Kira. <laughs> I'm a super contest show judge. Please drop by the contest house so that I can thank you properly. I don't know if I spelled or butchered her name. I just saw Kira for a second. But yeah, okay. Um, Let's go up here and let's actually go to the... Poke Center. I feel like with the team that I have currently, going to the Poke Center is definitely something we need to do. <clears throat> okay. Well, hello, Nostroy. How have you been? I've been doing pretty well. Yes. If you see that I almost have six Pokemon. Yes. We do know that one of them is a baby. And we... I hope to see you again too. Okay, that is enough of that. Let us go up here. Who is this? Oh, I'm so sorry. Please excuse a moi. Are you entering a super contest show? Oh, enjoy yourself, please. Incidentally, Fantina, the heart thrown gym leader, also happens to be a contest show expert. And you may ask yourself, how do I know this? Well, I am Fantina. You may challenge me, but not yet. You must become much stronger. Then you may challenge me. You now that's kind of funny. Like, Fantina says that I have to become stronger. As if she knows how strong I am already. Oh, my hero. Oh, hi, Jay, today. Wait, no, really? Joanna's your mom? So you might be a super contest show star. Oh, I don't know about that. I've never spoken to Jay today about super contest shows. I'm surprised you two know each other though. Oh yes, that's all right. I need to thank you for earlier. Please take this sticker. We obtained one ethereal sticker. Place that sticker on one of your Pokeball capsules before a show. It will lend a nice touch of sophistication and glamour. I'm a show judge, so come join us up for all kinds of fun. If you're unsure of yourself, we also offer practice sessions. Okay, Joanna, I'll see you. Were you surprised to see me Jay today? I got bored so I came out to Heart Throne for a little vacation. I'm just as surprised to see you here my dear. But you are you serious about entering the Super Contest show? Not dressed that way. It's your Pokemon time to shine so you shouldn't be dressed your usual way. Put this on for a little glamour. Wow so we have a tux we, we get a tuxedo? I to be honest kind of want to try that on. But I wonder if this is something that I could try on while I'm playing the game. 
but yeah i'm no interested in contests we are here to obtain gym badges and complete the pokedex so that is what we shall be doing let's talk to this guy real quick i'm visiting all the way from hoenn region oh wow okay so he is here far oh no he's just taking me to the contest you know, I think it will be a really, really solid idea if we have like a journey that Ash went through. Like, how about like one game that culminates every single game or region that has um, been featured thus far. So, you know, we start from Kanto and then we make our way to Johto and then we go to Hoenn and then Sinnoh. I know that will probably never happen, but I think it will be very nice. Looks like we have allies. Ta-da! Kept me waiting again, Jay, today. Let's see how much tougher you and I have gotten right here and now. Hey, you're a trainer now. You're expected to be ready for a battle. No whining. Let's get sh this show started. Okay, so it looks like we are facing Elias. <clears throat> okay, so this guy has four Pokemon, I'm guessing. Yeah, the f he still has a Starly. Dude, you need to train your Pokemon. We have our scrambles out in front, and I am confident that our scrambles can take this Starly apart. See, that was nothing. We got a rock type move for this Starly. We're gonna be crushing its feathers. That was a lot of damage. Oh, yeah, I'll show you something wicked too. I really hope that he's not changing Pokemons. That's good. Okay, so he's gonna use double team. That's fine. I am I'm confident that our ancient power is going to hit, and it didn't hit. Dang. Endeavor? That was pretty clever. Not going to lie, that was pretty clever, Elias. But unfortunately, you fell short. Alright, one Pokemon down. Alright, so Grotto, we... Do you have something for Grottle? I guess this is where Falgo needs to shine. Mm. Yeah, might as well. Wow, looks like Barry has been using those stickers because that looks good. Man, I want that Grottle so bad. I just want a decent grass type on our team. I know I could get like Rose Raid or something, but. I'm still kind of on the fence about Rose Raid right now. Because the only reason is because I've never used a Rose Raid, so I don't really know what to expect. And right now, I feel like our Pokemon team is kind of weak, not gonna lie. It's lacking in a lot of areas. But who knows? Alright, so one more boom attack should be able to kill this Grottle. That is nice. like our Faco is gaining levels. That's good. Alright, what's your third Pokemon? A Weasel. That is perfect for our common Nari. But I kind of want to see what our Holy could do. So I'm going to switch out the Holy. Okay, looks like we don't have anything... Let's try to put this Buizel to sleep. Wait, did it miss? No, we flinched. Oh, that's why. Oh. Yes, put that Buizel to sleep. And then we're just gonna spam Draining Kiss so that some of our HP can also be restored. I think that's what it does. It's, it's like a variation of a moon blast or a weaker version of it, I, I think. Please heal. Okay, wow. We we just healed all of that damage. That's that is pretty insane. Yeah, this weasel is going down. Our Curlia is doing some work. Ever since it evolved, it's been um doing some damage. Alright, so the last Pokemon is a Ponyta, and we we have to show off our strength of Mumble. Come on. This is supposed to be Elias' Pokemon, but we have chosen Piplup as our starter. So, 
Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I... I'm not a huge fan as of right now. I still feel like Monferno and my, you know, usual team still sweeps everything much faster. I definitely realize that I'm having a little more trouble within the gameplay only because my Pokemon is so weak right now. They're still baby Pokemon. But, you know, once they fully evolve, I think they will be quite a beast. Wow. You KO'd my team again? This messes up my dream of becoming the greatest trainer ever. No. I just need to get tougher and keep winning. One day. That's it. I'm going to challenge the Veil Sun Gym next. See you around, Jay, today. You'll be blown away by how much tougher I'll be next time we meet. I sincerely hope that is right. Okay, let's see if our Pokemon needs any healing. Yeah, our Pokemon definitely needs healing. So I'll be right back after I uh, go to the Pokemon Center. Okay, that is what, like our third time going to the Pokemon Center. Uh, let's actually go to the shop and buy some repels too. Um, I just don't want to encounter any Pokemon right now because my main uh, focus when I'm playing at the moment is to progress with the game so that you could, you know, see me progress with the game, right? Um, we don't want to be encountering any wild Pokemon because that's just going to significantly hinder it. So we need to buy some good repels. Okay, I think we're supposed to go this way and down. I'm not sure. Okay, so obviously not that way. Um, although I've played this game on the DS many a times, uh, I still kind of get lost sometimes. I don't know why. Um, but yeah. I'm pretty sure this is the way that we need to go. We're going to... Oh, come on. Looks like we have a battle. down here and it looks like we have a doubles battle um yeah i'm happy with the composition let's take them on seriously need to train my Pokemon off screen um, I can tell that my Pokemon are very weak right now uh, let's oh man we have another trainer that's all right let's take her on Six, but doofs like what? My God. Okay, so we have a made it to Solacion Town, and to be honest, I think I am just going to end um, this episode here. Uh, I know it was a shorter episode. We had a lot of battles, but um, 
yeah we're just gonna end it here for today and next time we will make our way to Veilstone city so yeah hope you guys had a great time and i'll see you guys later goodbye